Hey guys, it's Pro, and welcome back to another episode of Terra. <coughs> Last time, we ran around and completed most of the quests in the area, and this time, I decided to take a lap before I started this episode to see if I could find the Keltasad Vulcan, and it looks like I was successful. Is this guy, he's only level 60, which means that he should be within our range to deal with, so let's try and kill him really quick and see if we can get that achievement out of the way. Go ahead. Do a hell of a lot of damage to this guy. I whiffed. I whiffed. Alright, so going in, just keep dealing damage to this guy. There we go, keep going, keep going. We're making really good progress. Seven thousand damage if I screw up, that's really bad. And there we are, Felling Kel. So, dang, that's pretty good though. So if I go ahead and check out Encounters and Exploration in Southern Shara, <laughs> Felling Kel, 30 points. And if we go down to Rural Southern Shara, we have Nixaris left. And this, which we'll get later. But just Nixaris is left for us to tackle. Oh man, I'm excited. So I'll meet you guys back where we start this episode. So, uh, see you guys in a little bit. Alright, so now we're pretty much back where we started. Uh, I just found this plentiful Zer Metal Ore, and I thought I'd try my hand at it, see if I could get any more rare items out of it. Unfortunately, so far, no luck. But, um, I think now we're gonna go ahead and go to... Ugh, we didn't get any. God oh, dang it. We're gonna go ahead and head out this way over towards uh, the entrance to Blood Valley at Checkpoint Ebony. Or towards Checkpoint Ebony. Which I believe is this camp over here. Yes. So we're gonna enter the very, very ominous looking area. Which is, of course, guarded by a scorpion! Alright. 46 experience. Oh yeah, there's more scorpions. Quick run! Hello, Belay. <coughs> Sorry if I got for sniffle quite a bit. It's like a, I'm getting over a sickness, supposedly. I don't actually know if I'm sick. I probably sound sick. But I also woke up like 30 minutes ago. So, I'm going to go ahead and just accept all these missions. Alright. So now what do we got to do? Uh, collect Valken soldiers' necklaces, five Magmar Terraliths. I believe we actually have to kill 50. If I remember correctly. Yeah. Probably do that later. And then, that's it, actually. Alright, well, we'll head off this way and get rid of these Tenebrara sorcerers and lancers, like we're supposed to. Need to kill six groups of these guys. I didn't crit him. What else is this way? I see two numbers over here. And then oh, I need to kill ten, ten of Briar Reapers. They're probably also over here. 
<laughs> no, they're not. <coughs> what else is over here? Unless those are both three, because there's two enemies to kill, which actually might be the case. God, that was very awkward mo camera movement. Alright. So gotta do two more. Alright, and your last and the least. I just whiffed. There we are. Alright, let's go ahead, and we have a Magmar Terralith here. Let's go ahead and start taking them down. <coughs> there we are. The nice thing is they're very easy to take down. So yeah, now after that killing that one dude, all we have left to destroy is uh, the one Nixaris. That's all we have to do. All right, hello. Ooh, dead bodies are over there. So we get trial by blood achievement for killing those enemies. I don't know why we get that. Let's go ahead and pick up this dead body's necklace. Oh, you rolled into me? Can I get this first? Oh my god, I can't get it. So close. Now I can get it in peace. <laughs> All right. All right, there we go. There's four. We are gonna go ahead and tackle that Terralith as well because it's also guarding a dead body, of which it's mine. Wait, did you guys just respawn? You must have. Anyway, whatever. You're running a dead body. I need to pick up the necklace, so. <clears throat> oh my god, come on. Computer, calm down. <laughs> All right. Well, let's go ahead and deal with you. There's six. Loot a corpse. I think there's another one right over there. Which is four. That should be number five. Yes. <coughs> and I guess the other Tempora Reaper is going to be down there. So that's done. Let's go ahead and deal with you and y oh, there's some over there. All right. Oh, come on. Bye. <laughs> I killed the scorpion. Rip the scorpion. <laughs> I think this should be. Oh no, that's eight. All right. I come over here, kill you, kill you, and then kill you, and then I'll be done. Yay! Terra looks to kill. You know, I'll just kill that one because it's closer. 
Alright, hello. Come on. You're gonna kill me at this rate, buddy. Jeez. The good thing I have that backup. That could have been very problematic. Alright, let's just go ahead and head on back, turn out all these quests. Alright, so turn into you. Turn into you. And then turn into you. And you don't give me another mission to head down deeper. Alright. Give and take, then. Oh, I got a new shirt. It is better than what I have. Alright, let's get some more defense. <coughs> oh, whoops. I thought it wasn't on my horse. Alright. Go ahead and head down here. Because we need to go talk to Torsten. It's going to be over there near that thing. There's going to be a lot of Magmar Terraliths right around here. We're pretty much going to ignore them for the most part. Because we're not doing that grindy achievement yet. We'll do it probably at the beginning of the next episode if we've cleared everything so far. Torsten, Torsten! You're in the middle? Uh. Oh, you guys aren't going to aggro on me. Hello, Torsten. Teleporter takes you to the heart of Killian's Lair. Are you ready? I'm going to Jester's Villa. We gotta kill. We gotta eliminate Killian and get the last relic fragment. <coughs> right, welcome to the Jester's Villa. Gotta get rid of Killian. Oh, you guys are weak. You guys are like really, really weak. Things just force knocked down. Oh. <laughs> Welcome, friends. See, Killian, I told you they'd bring all three relics. How gracious of them. I'll take those. But I suppose you deserve a reward. How about pain? Squirm, you worms! Turn immediately. But I was about to welcome them. The Master Smith is making something. Something interesting. If we seize the Divine Furnace, their relics are useless. Come help me, now. But that's not fair. I was about to play with the mortals. Pull out the eyes. Peel off the skin. Dance to the screams. Until, Until they scream no more. <laughs> Yours, I guess. Oh, um, alright. So I guess we have to now, since we can't deal with Killian, we're gonna have to eliminate, um, Snaharzim. Killian's pet. It's not a dog, but it's a pet. Transform into Killian's organized pet. Alright. Are you guys all gonna still chase me down? What the 
that's on cooldown. Stupid Kelvas. Alright, well, we're done. So, you know what? We're only like 12 minutes into this. I guess I can go around and do the Magmar Terralith achievement for now since we're in the area. And we need to go back to Freya anyway. So, there's no point not doing it now. He's got to get over with. I think I might also go do another round for Nixaris since um, I happen to be in the area as well. He should be nearby. <clears throat> Once I go back to Elenia just before the Pegasus fly out, I'll go ahead and I'll look for him a little bit. But I guess for now we're going to uh, put this to some music. And I'll see you guys uh, on the other end once I've killed all uh, the remaining 45 Magmar Terraliths. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys shortly.
Now we're back. We did it, guys. <clears throat> there we go. Now we have like a rock. We're almost done with all the Southern Shara achievements. <laughs> all we have left to do is get Nixaris, which then also finishes Rule Southern Shara, and then we have to go to the Bastion, to Bastion, where we'll get this and this. And all we'll have left is Pesticide. Damn. So you know what? <clears throat> I think I'm gonna go ahead and look around for Nixaris really quick, because now we're done with everything here. We can go back to Freya. So what I'm gonna do is I am going to. Uh, teleport back to Elenia, and I'll make a round looking for Nixaris. If I can't find him, I'll meet you guys at the Pegasus platform. If I do, then uh, we'll just uh, fight him, and then return to Elenia, and proceed. See you guys in a little bit. Alright, now we're back. Unfortunately, I couldn't find Nixaris, which is a bit of a bummer, but for now, we're just gonna head back to Alamanthea, and we're gonna go talk to Freya. 
And I mean, man, I just, I can't believe that we're almost completely done with Southern Chara. I think Southern R and, yeah, we're also almost done. And you get a Divine Reaver and Tempest Kanash, which we'll do later. Tempest Kanash, we're definitely doing later. He's level 68. We're not doing this till endgame. Um, Northern Shara, we only have a couple things. We do have a lot more we need to do. Especially, um, at Amenakwatla. <coughs> I never found... I believe we went to... Did we go to Plane of the Damned? I don't even know if we went to Plane of the Damned. Still haven't been to Seelywood. We're gonna go there eventually. Where's the Plane of the Damned? I think that's in Lorcata. Yeah, there it is. Okay, so we haven't been here yet. I believe this is actually the next place we're heading, though. So... You may very well be looking on the lookout for Yunara's Snaggletooth. And then we're also going to be doing these. Then we need to go to Seelywood at some point. And so on. Under Miscellaneous, I believe all of this is stuff we can't do till the end of the... Yeah. Island of Dawn, Island of Dawn. These are all Island of Dawn except for four. Which we'll do later. And then Northern Iron, we've literally done zero. No, no spoilers. That, I just, I said no spoilers, then I just provided spoilers. Whatever. Alright. <clears throat> Let's see what, how we're doing over here. The light 50k, we're almost 40% of the way done with that, which is nice. Kill a thousand big ones. We're getting there. 10,000 minions, we're also getting there. Just another 200 left. Damn. Um. Peter is very angry. Um. All by myself. So we need all, if we get one with giants, we get this all by myself 90 or 60 point achievement. Which is for doing all the one with quests. So as you can want Basilis, Ovaliths, Kumasas, Claw Riders, Nagas, Dracolots, Ice Reavers, Lithic Kumasas, War Masters, Warlords. So once we do one with giants here, we're going to get this achievement as well. So bam bam, we've killed 200 named bosses out of 5,000. It's a good start. <laughs> Kumasakur. We need to kill all of these enemies. Jeez, that's a lot. <clears throat> Retaliate or proto violence. We're gonna do that. We're gonna grind this one out later when we go back and do all the. Uh, uh, da, 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 da. When we do all the big, or when we do all the um, dungeon missions, or, or where we have to go and grind them a bunch. I'm gonna try to get this one because there's a lot of really weak enemies that we'll be able to use. I'll wait for them to knock me down, and then use retaliate to kill like 40 or 50 of them at a time. <laughs> big game hunter. Filet 50k, 1,000 big ones, and 10,000 small. We almost have both of these. And so we almost have that one. <laughs> What's this one? Oh, yeah. Okay, we'll get to that later. All right. Well, we're going to go ahead and head over and see Freya. I also don't actually know how long this episode is, so I might only go a little bit longer. Depends on how long or how uh, short I decide to condense the Magmar Terrorist stuff into. I didn't have to step away for, like, uh, 12 minutes or something like that. So, unfortunately... Yeah, this, it's gonna be either that... I don't know what I'm gonna keep. I'm probably gonna cut that out of this section. I don't even know. I probably will, though. Anyway, let's go ahead and see Freya. We're all brothers here. We're all brothers here. Alright. Ah. So, do 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 Here we go. Also, I'm, I'm curious, how many Pegasus flights do we have right now? <coughs> uh, 25, we're halfway there. It only gives us one gold for completing it, but like, hey, it's money. Money is money and money matters. How much money do I have? I have 3,000, alright. Hello, Freya. The entire Federation, male and female, adult and child, grieves that you could not gather the relic fragments. Killian may be insane, but he's not to be trifled with. Without all four fragments, we cannot hope to defeat Kelsaic. You Yet you fell one fragment short. Do you remember the pendant that Kyderun gave me? Of course. <laughs> when gambling, it helps to have a wild card, does it not? Consider the pendant such a wild card, for it can substitute for the fourth fragment. You know the risks. The pendant contains most of the core's power. If it's lost, or worse, taken, Alamanthea will collapse within days. I will hold Alamanthea together as long as I can. Stop Kelsaic. Stop Thulsa. Avenge Kaiden. Alright, so now we need to go talk to Kaya in Kyater. And I guess we can go over more of the achievements that we have to do and what we can do them. So we have Essence of the Core. So let's go ahead and talk to Buren and leave. 
And then we'll go ahead and seek out Kaya in Kyater and let her know that we have uh, three Relic Fragments plus a sub for the fourth. Oh, uh, man. I don't know, I'm excited. I this part of the game coming up is actually pretty exciting, except for the one, uh, except for a bunch of the dungeons we have to do, because they're going to be really long. There's even one that I can't solo because a boss has an attack that's uncounterable, and it, and it will one-shot me. I believe it's one of the only dungeons that I can't solo on a brawler. If I'm careful. Anyway, let's we'll talk to a Krill here. We're going to go ahead and head to Kyeter. So we can keep going over achievements. Um, <coughs> doing pretty okay here. Fashion icon. We're gonna do this one later. This one we won't do for a while. Because I actually don't know how to die items. So I'm gonna learn that with you guys. Which will be great. Um, yeah, we almost have the last level one. Actually, we don't. We're still 14% into level 60. We're, we're not getting any experience for any of this. What about Tours of Duty? How are we doing there? <laughs> Alright, so we almost have How Deep Is Your Lore? This one we cannot complete without doing daily missions, so I'll try to keep on top of that and just do the daily missions. I believe I can do 10 a day, and I'll try to keep on to that, even if I'm not recording an episode at the time. Just because that way we'll still be able to get this achievement. So then we have all these other ones that are just like, complete all these quests, complete all these quests, complete the quests, <coughs> uh, complete the quests. Uh, complete quests, complete quests, complete quests. Kyder Mission Specialist we get for completing specifically uh, 12 quests. Special Forces, once we complete Kyder Mission Specialist we get this one, Riding Seal Carming, which is a b temporary Blood Red Dra uh, Draco Raptor mount. And we get it for 21 days. That's nice. Never Forgiven nor Forgotten, completing a bunch of quests. Tales of the Valkyrie, also two quests. Um, and then so on. Alright, well here we are. <coughs> Welcome back to Kyeter, and for some reason it wasn't loading, that was very strange. Let's go ahead and head over this way. And get stuck on the lip here that exists for some reason. That's a bug that needs to be fixed. And then we'll go ahead and talk to you, Nari. Well, say something. Oh, wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. I don't want to do either of those yet, we just didn't teleport in. I was about to progress those two quests. Whew! Do not want to do those yet. Okay, so now that we're in Kyder Command Center, we go ahead and go in, and Kai is, of course, standing just in the back, being the goddess. A lot more present than Velik is, considering that Velik has taken on a disguise to hide <laughs> among everybody, whereas Kaya's just here, like, actually ruling her, um, her region. Anyway. What do you, see? you have retrieved three Frolic Fragments, and I see Freya has sacrificed Britley to make up for the missing fourth. You have done well. I could make the weapon to destroy Kelsake right now, but Thulsa sees the Divine Furnace. He must know we're up to something. The legendary <laughs> Omni blacksmith Murak can create a vessel to hold the fragment's power. I sent him ahead to prepare the Divine Furnace, where he can do such wondrous work. I sent him ahead unwisely, it seems. Thulsa controls the furnace, Murak is missing, and I don't know whether he will be able to complete the vessel in time. So we're gonna we gotta go look for the blacksmith, but first we gotta talk to Tomor uh, or Tomor and ask if he has any info. Murak, he really exists? I thought he was just a legend. I don't know anything about Murak, but Prefect Bayath and Haber sent us a message. Only one apprentice escaped the Divine Furnace with those attacked. If anyone knows what happened to Mirak, it, it'll be that apprentice. He's under Garid's protection in Haber. Victory for Valthian. Alright, so we got a fragment of my former self achievement. Which is good. <coughs> and now we have Into the Furnace. So now we gotta make our way over to Haber. Which we don't have an easy way to get there. I love this number, it's just going down. We're doing great. Ah, I'm excited. <coughs> Go ahead. And make our way over to Haber, which I was right, is indeed the next section. So we're going to go to Forge Heart. I don't need this page open anymore. Uh, I don't believe I have to worry. Yeah, we're done with Southern Shara bosses besides Nixaris, which you just gotta wait for him to show up. Alright, we're still ignoring you. I don't want to talk to you, Nari, until I work on those quests. Oh, wait. Oh, that way. Whoops! 
let's go ahead and make our way over to Haber, and I think that's actually where we'll end this episode. I don't actually know how long it's going to be, but I think that's probably a good time in Lorcata. <coughs> and now we're flying on Dracoloths. No, wait, we're on Wyverns. Okay, let's see. Dungeons and Battlegrounds we can ignore, extracurriculars. We have a gold, actually. If we look at summary, we have a gold, a gold, and two silvers. This, we still don't have a ranking yet. <coughs> so, silver means it completed 40%, uh, gold is 60%, diamond is 80%, champion is 95%. It's the same deal as our own ribbons. But anyway, so, do do, -do under extracurriculars, enchanting, like I said, was done, gathering. We just have to fight, we have to get them to 350, which if I look at our gathering, I can't look at them right now, we're flying. Yeah, I can't look at them. I can only hit X. So this, we just need to get these to 350, and then we get all mine. <laughs> and then we do part items. I believe it's just oh, I, okay, laggy. That was weird. Um, get more rare items. You speed potions that I don't have yet. I may have to. If I can purchase these, I'm gonna try to, just so I can use them. So money don't need to say a thing. We require 5,000 gold. I'm gonna get these drinker potions, especially when we start going into dungeons. Legendary looter is gonna be. This one is gonna take way too long to get. Anyway, we're gonna get uh, in rare form eventually. This one will probably be one of the. So these two will probably end up being so one of the last couple of achievements we get. And then we have the one percent, and we're ignoring special because it doesn't matter. Although we do have twenty-two out of five hundred special achievements. Uh, special achievements only add to this number and do not subtract from this number. This laurel does not count any special achievements. It only counts the other five categories. Anyway, welcome to Haber. So here we are starting off around the Plane of the Dam. So now we have a uh, Haber Tourist, another 10 points. We're going to go ahead and talk to Garid, and I think that'll probably be the point where we got the episode. <coughs> I actually, you know, I think actually... How dare Tholso desecrate this land? Kaya claims Haber is her own. I'll fight to the death to keep any so-called death gods away from here. That's not why you're here. The apprentice who escaped, now that he's regained consciousness, sure, talk to him all you want. I think, actually, next time we'll head over to Sealywood, actually. And just complete that area. Because I do not believe there are any story missions out there. So, we're going to talk to Stolen, who's going to... Or not Stolen. We need to talk to... Pedestal who will actually teleport us to Sealywood. <clears throat> so I want to actually go south. Talk to the apprentice. But yeah, I think next time we're just we're gonna go to Sealywood and we're gonna complete the area and then come back to Haber. Because having a little bit of extra XP in our belt is never a bad thing. Talk to the escaped apprentice. What can I do for you? They also took over the molten chamber, which supplies heat to the main furnace. He demanded our cooperation, but Blacksmith Murek and his Omni engineers refused. So Thulsa killed all the engineers with a wave of his hand, like snuffing out candles. My eyes were closed after that, but I think Murek escaped. There was quite a commotion anyway. They made us erect a shield around the molten chamber. I got the sense they'd kill us when we finished, so I made a break for it. Alright, I'm going to go back and talk to Gareed if I don't get stuck. And so I'm pretty much gonna cut this when they uh, ask us to leave the leave the town. So let's go ahead and go back to Garid very slowly. Ah, slightly overshot. Dead Omni, enslaved apprentices, and outrage! But I've got good news. We saved another straggler, a human apprentice at Haber's western gate. Find out what he knows. If the apprentice can point you toward the caravan they're moving they're using to move their prisoners around, then liberate those prisoners. Uh where are you? Wait. Plane of the dam. Oh, we need to go rescue him. So yeah. I think next time on Terra, we're gonna go ahead and make our way towards um Sealywood, using that one uh, Mandrake as our teleporter, because I want to clear out that area first, because we have no other reason to go back there later, if I remember correctly. So, next time, we're going to go ahead and head to Scythera Fey, and meet with Mandrake Regent Tanseril to help clear that area before we go and save that uh, Popery Technician. See you guys then.